Hi there. This video will show you how to install the MM Guardian parental control application onto your child's Android phone. First, go to the Google Play Store and search MM Guardian parental control. Be sure to select the MM Guardian parental control app for kids phone, not the MM Guardian parent app. Touch the install button and accept the required permissions. On some phones, you may be asked to reconfirm all of the permissions required, so just press confirm. Now you can open up the app. You'll now see screens describing some of the MM Guardian functions. Either tap skip on the first screen, or swipe right to left to view the screens. On the last one, tap on Get Started. If this is the first time you've registered with MM Guardian, select No. To register the app, you'll enter the parent's phone number, the parent's email address, and your choice of password. Make sure your password is more secure than what I'm entering here. Tap the register button. If the Android system is not able to read the child phone's number, you'll be asked to enter it in this pop-up screen. Once the app has been registered, you'll be asked to enable some settings that will help the app operate reliably. The first is accessibility. When you hit Enable, you'll be taken to an Android setting screen. On some phones, you will need to scroll down until you find the entry for MM Guardian. Tap the On Off button. Most phones will then require you to reconfirm that you want to turn this on. Next is App Monitoring. Tap Enable. Again, you'll be taken to an Android setting screen. Tap the On Off switch to turn it on. You may need to tap on the back arrow if you are not automatically returned to the MM Guardian app. The third step is uninstall protection. Tap Enable to get to the Android Device Administrator screen. Press Activate. In the final step, you'll be given the option to enable MM Guardian messaging. Enable it if you want to be able to block SMS messages. SMS messages will be allowed or blocked based on what you set in call block. If enabled, the MM Guardian messaging app will become the default Android messaging app and would be used by your child for SMS and MMS messaging. It's not necessary to enable this function just to get detailed SMS reports. The initial configuration of the app is now complete. However, you'll need to set up your desired configurations for key app functions such as time limits, app control, call block, or web filtering. Most of these functions can be set up directly in this child phone app. However, you can also configure the app remotely from a parent app installed in your phone or from the secure parent web portal. In this case, I'm going to remotely configure the app, so I will just exit out of it now. Since we enabled the MM Guardian messaging function, you can now see that an app icon for the messaging app has been added to the phone's home screen. Please see our other videos for installing the parent app and setting up the numerous features that MM Guardian offers. Have a great day, and thanks for choosing MM Guardian.